Hello everyone, thank you so much for watching. Before you do anything else, please like, subscribe, and share. Follow me on Instagram, I'll leave it right here. So I have this thing where I paint a painting and I fall in love with it for years and it doesn't sell. It's just sitting and taking up space and I decide one day, okay, I'm no longer attached to this painting. I can now paint over it and make something else of it. So this right here used to be a painting I painted of a guy and a girl dancing. I'll put it up right here so you can see it. So in this painting, I did a lot of florals and I cut out a lot of flowers from denim or from some board shorts that I have. And then the dress had those flowers in her pattern. So now fast forward to the cow now. I kept some of those denim flowers. I kept the yellow background. I kept part of the outline of the dress. I'm gonna lighten up this, make this a very psychedelic painting of a cow, abstracted. There's gonna be a lot of pattern because I love, love, love pattern. This is just an idea that you can do when you have paintings and you don't know what to do with them. Just paint over them and repurpose them. The great thing about that is that you get a really good layering effect that happens. Like here you can still see parts of the painting underneath it and a lot of them I'm going to keep showing through. So once you paint on top of a painting, it adds a whole different level of dimension, makes it look very interesting and you can actually tell that there's been a lot of work and time put into it. which I which there has been because there used to be another one back here now it's layered on top of another one. Some of this had oil on it so the, you can't put acrylic over oil. So what I do, I cover it with gesso and then I start again with acrylic. So this is what it looks like now and then when I'm done I'll come back with it and see what it looks like. Hey, so this is what she looks like right now and I love the way it's coming out. It's very psychedelic and the best part of it is the tactile, tactile, tactile. Tool. The way it feels. There's a lot of different textures in here like the denim and the flowers and a lot of this is like very thick layered paint. I know it's very busy but I'm gonna do a lot of white flowers that it's gonna subdue the busyness of it all. I, light, I lightened the background yellow just because it was too bright. Yeah this is what she looks like now and I'm so obsessed with her. I love her. Hey, so the cow is finally done. I love the way it looks. It's very psychedelic, very pop art, abstract cow with a lot of daisies, a lot of heavy use of pattern that I'm really into now. Oh my god, you can see my underwear. <laughs> I need pants. I forgot what I said, but anyway. <laughs> It's a very abstract, very brightly colored cow. Uh, a lot of flowers and daisies, very spring. I painted a lot of realistic cows in the previously, so now I'm into this like cow craze, but it's gonna be a little bit more abstracted, and this is the first one that I'm doing in, the, in this collection that I'm working on. I think my favorite part about this painting is the tactile quality about it. Like I said, it has the denim flowers, it has a lot of just things added on to it that make it three-dimensional, but you can't see that in photograph or in the video. Now this frame I think really adds a nice touch to it. I think frames can either distract or add to the piece. I think in this case a frame was necessary because when you paint on very thin canvases, the larger they are, the higher the probability of them warping. Especially with me that I use a lot of like washes. So if the stretcher gets wet, then the wood warps. So I this had to have a frame and I really like this one because it's just nice black that complements the outline very sleek and yeah tell me what you think of the painting oh, and go ahead and follow me on Instagram if you want to see more of the art that I do and until next time adios you buy a and subscribe and watch a lot of watch out and watch the other content in my channel till next time adios you bye